Hey, it's Dave and Bruno. We are back from York. I was traveling. Some of you have missed me. You've asked, where's the bike corral? Well, that's coming up next. And also, I have some more footage of the swap meet. It's a lot of footage to edit while I'm also traveling. We have the Rokon Romp in Ocala coming up this week, uh, along with Mecham Las Vegas is going on right now as we speak. I did get some stuff there. I'm gonna show you what that's like when you're bidding online. And what else is going on? Oh yeah, we got a BDR, a Florida BDR ride with a group of buddies this weekend too. So it's gonna be a busy week. Stay tuned. Here's an IT-175, which some folks say is the best IT. Looks like DG plastics, except for the tank. An Arctic Cat sign. A DT-250. A late Elsinore. A Hodaka tank. That's a Sax Madass way in the back there. We got some bicycle engines. I watch your videos all the time. Oh, thank you. Where's Dennis? Nice to meet you. Hi, Dennis. Thank you. And now, are you are you shopping today or? Going I did yesterday. I'm sort of out of money. <laughs> okay, this is a beta trials, but it's got the tank and seat kit, which is unusual. It makes it look more rideable. Here's a CZ. How about an unrestored CZ? Thirty-four hundred. A little Yamaha 80, a small Sherpa, an S90, here's a CL360, not a big fan of the 360s. Oh, uh, we saw this. This is a thing powered by an electric drill, and it really goes. Drill bikes. I don't think they make them anymore. An easy go. Probably a YZ60. Yeah. A GB500. Okay, Steve. Let's see if there's a price on it. No price. 2,300 miles. A little bit of pitting from sitting. Pitting from sitting. A Gixer. Two Gixers. Oh, it's a CBR and a Gixer. I think we missed some stuff down here. Oh, I walked right past this standing tank thing. 2021 DTV Shredder. Wonder if that works in the Florida sand. Let's go see what's outside. Oh, these with the Megura levers, but with the gray rubbers. I don't know if they reproduce the gray ones. Tank not for sale. The graphics are. Uh, no. 
Looking under the table. Runs and rides great. Can Am 125, very motivated to sell. 609 969 0700. I told you I'd get to the bike corral. I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Here we are, the bike corral. That's the nicest one right there. The silver. You know, I was walking by, I thought it was a Cannondale, but then I saw the two-stroke pipe. Honda, man. Well, because it's silver and black. Yeah. You don't see many silver and black Hondas. Yeah. There's his phone number. 610-451-13, no, that's 3875. Penton, all right, so what I'm gonna do, instead of reading them out, I'm gonna try to show. You'll have to pause, and I hope these turn out. Here is a nice six days. Okay. Oh. Six grand. I don't know which way to go. Sold. 72, 2300 bucks. Well, that's why it's sold. Same guy, Mako Magnum, $49.50. Same guy, Mark Satterley, here in Pennsylvania. Mako 250 and a Mako 400. Uh, I, I'm Dave. Dave Najarian. Hi, Dennis. Hi, yeah, you said hi before. Oh, so you're Mark. He's Mark, but he's just putting his name on Oh, okay. Oh, okay. All right, so we do we have time to do the smalls? I'm not knowledgeable on the smalls, so you guys are going to have to excuse me. Uh, of course, we got copyrighted music I might have to bleep out. Vintage Japanese Motorsports Swap Meet and Show. August 16th, 17th, and 18th, rain or shine. Held at Eastern Museum of Motor Racing, Lattimore Valley Road, York Springs, PA. There you go. Now you know what I know, which is nothing. What the heck is that? I don't know. Looks unusual. All right, we gotta check this out. Rickman, Matisse, Triumph, 650. Ooh. Rickman, Matisse, MK3 have import info with rebuilt Triumph engine. 
bunch of stuff sold as package 9,000 Rick Slayman can't read it but it is 609 529-7710 Street it and that should go on our next cross Florida tour. What do you think? Honda taco So that's Looks like a 123 Astro frame I'm guessing by the swing arm. No, 145. Uh, yeah, they did that a lot. Last year, somebody said, I don't show enough Montessas. Oh, this is George Ackerman. He's got the Moto Barn. The Moto Barn in Virginia, I think. You should look him up. He holds an event every year. And this is a Suzuki. I don't know. It's not an X6 Hustler. What is it? TL250. It's not a TL250, is it? Maybe it is. Did I show the phone number? Can you read that? 3500. CT90. $800 step through. Reduced. That's not going to stay. MT250. MX250. Seven one seven seven two nine three six three zero. Rust Bucket Bill, $4,000 Coda, and the Mini Coda. Now, I know they get good money for these in the Voltaco, the little tiny ones. I wonder what they get for them in the Montessa. $250 R, what year? 2007. The little Yamaha 100. <laughs> Gemco Mitch Barn. There's his phone number, 175 Jack Heiner, $2,500. 440 WR, same model as the Steve McQueen bike. But Steve McQueen owned a lot of bikes. The stiletto. Another small Persang. <laughs> Hi. Here's my Greaves. Anybody interested in a 380 Greaves QUB, give me a shout. Here's a Water Buffalo. A Suzuki. Boy, if I missed the phone number, I don't want to get anyone upset at me. I'm doing my best. $2,000 for that 550 
Ready, it says. We know what a Honda Gyro is. That's that scary tilting three wheeler thing. This is a Gyro X. Somebody wants this, not me. But let me tell you about it. It says bill of sale, Japanese import. 978-846-3323-2250 and it probably costs half that much to just get it here so you should buy it another step through Arriva I don't know what that is Suzuki Mullet 50 that's another Japanese import 1200 bucks bill of sale Imported from Italy, Vespa, powered, as seen at MoMA NYC, 1300 bucks. It's a Taljet, I don't know what that is. Honda, so we got a lot of weird Japanese import stuff here. And they look to be all the same guy. Call or text. 978-846-3323 to hear that steve in tampa this is all up your alley a ktm foxy tell your friends you bought a new ktm uh-huh and they might be proud maybe Kawasaki Bushmaster 90. Seven one seven three three zero one one six seven. Holy crap! This is a Campera. I think that's a one seventy five. It's a four speed. Pretty nice. Another stiletto. I 
I need that side spring. Nine hundred bucks. Nine hundred bucks. Four ten two oh seven nine five three six. An XT five hundred. There's a special starting technique for those. I'm gonna grab the phone number real quick. There you go. Suzuki, Yamaha, CR 480R, $8,500. Well, we got to find the other part of the corral. There's a whole other part. 91 KTM 125. Is this an Italian Husqvarna? 2001. And it got it flipped for the phone number. I don't know if you can see that, hopefully. Same guy, Doug. Same guy for that Husqvarna. Little SRX 250. KX250, Brad Little, same guy has that KTM. KDX 400. IT 175. So, well, I gotta go pick up my stuff. I don't know what order I'll get these posted. So you'll see them. Stay tuned, subscribe, follow, whatever.